Hello and welcome back to the Basie YouTube channel. Thanks for clicking on the video and today I want to talk about how you can make the most and maximize your time during lockdown and out of lockdown for that matter too. And see like if you're anything like me my brain is consistently and constantly worrying. I always have to be focusing on something um, otherwise I start to develop anxieties in the day if I don't do something till too late. I've always got to keep my mind occupied on something whether it's podcasts, listening to um, yeah, listening to podcasts, reading books, or coming up with business ideas, uh, working on stuff for my company and the startup. Um, there's a lot of things that are consistently going on in my head. And for me, when I'm satisfied and I go to bed happy is when I've completed all these things and I feel fulfilled in the work that I've done today and I've had those outlets. Um, so I want to talk to you about the three, tr this triangle philosophy that I kind of have in my mind uh, and it creates a perfect balance for me uh, in order to be fulfilled and happy. So this is my triangle philosophy and there's no reason why it's a triangle. It's purely just because in my head there's three main points to it and the, the image of a triangle helps with that. So there's no logical reason to it. And the whole goal of this philosophy is to keep your brain stimulated. And that's why I write it in the middle is that I want to feel like I'm continuously being productive and enjoying my life and, and being happy with what I'm doing. Now there's three points to the triangle. Firstly, I have the physical and this is all about uh, feeling physically good. So whether it's working out, going for a run, uh, doing body weight exercises, whatever that might be, you need to physically engage and stimulate your body uh, to feel satisfaction in that way. I realize that might sound wrong, but let's go with it. <laughs> okay, let's get this workout. And the second part is work. This is the thing that should be taking up or, or most likely will be taking up most of your life. For me, it's working in a startup and it's important for, for my brain to be stimulated that whatever I'm working at, I feel like I'm progressing, I'm learning a lot and it's, you know, contributes towards my skill set. So it's gotta be something that I enjoy, that I feel like I can progress in uh, and that I'm happy with to get that kind of stimulation from work. So whatever work you have, whether that's working at uni or at a job or maybe just working on yourself, um, it needs to be somewhat structured and disciplined so that you can come out at the end of day having known that you've done that time and you can be satisfied with that. Um, for me, it's easier now that I'm not in university to have a more structured, you know, nine till six, nine till 6.30 sort of working hours. But if you don't, try and set that structure. Um, and especially if you're at university or you're self-employed or whatever that might be. Um, really good tips from Cal Newport in his book by Deep Work is to try and get this, this sort of deadline restricted work done uh, in the morning uh, when there's no distractions and you can focus for two, three, four hours and try and get this deep work done uh, so you can be more productive. But yeah, I'll leave a link to uh, the lockdown video so you can see what a day in the life of working in a startup is like um, below. And then lastly is this kind of creative side. And this is really important for me uh, to be able to scratch this itch. So as I mentioned, I try and make videos, podcasts, uh, coming up with startup ideas. And that's something that I've been able to explore a bit more now we're in lockdown and, and had this slowdown. Um, so I've been making mood boards uh, of products that I really find interesting and want to take inspiration from and that's helpful in my work too. Um, and editing videos, of course, this takes time and I've had more time as well to be more creative with my editing uh, and use that. So when I finish a video uh, at midnight and I've just done a long day's work plus a workout, 
um, I always feel great. So the goal for each of these three points is to be able to cause you to have this stimulation and be focused on something. I've been alone now for coming on to almost two months or yeah, maybe a month, month and a half uh, in my apartment by myself. And you know, it's very easy to lose concentration, lose the focus. And I just got into the swing of things of living in London, working at a startup and things being constant, constant, constant. And now it's just taken me some time to, to slow down and really take that in. Um, but I also don't want this time to inhibit my progress and where I want to be. So I've really focused on the three things that are going to get me to be productive, continue uh, moving forward in what in my goals and what I want to achieve um, and really make the most of this time. So a perfect lockdown day for me has been when I wake up 7.30 to 8 o'clock ish. Uh, I do a quick meditation, get to work, feel very fulfilled in what I'm doing during the day. I'm having lots of calls with people. Uh, then I finish up work do a quick workout, film a YouTube video, and by the time I look at my phone, it's midnight. And I would rather have that than be wasting and fumbling my time, wondering what I should do or everyone's slowing down. And that's been the most fulfilling for me. And a combination of all this has just made me happier during this lockdown. You can't conquer the whole world in one day. So try and focus on one of these points of the triangle. Uh, for me, I think what I would focus on first is probably my physical one. When I feel physically good, that sort of falls into place and has a domino effect on everything else that's going on. Uh, and it's important for your mental health as well. So for me, having this balance and then also taking time to relax so that I can know that I've done these sort of three things of working physically, um, working mentally, and also being creative. I can take that time to relax and enjoy just being in the apartment alone, which is strange at this time. Um, but focus on one thing at a time. Uh, let me know what content you want to see me producing in the future. I'm going to be posting more videos during this lockdown and continuing afterwards because this is something that I find fun and just want to keep doing and put myself out there. Um, if there's anything that you want me to talk about in my videos, let me know in the comments below. I'm going to try and get some more podcasts out soon because it's the perfect time to reach out to people. Um, but yes, like, subscribe, uh, send me a message if anyone wants to talk to me easily to reach me on LinkedIn or just any in the comment section below. Um, and I will speak to you guys in the next video. Take it easy.